again, Jesus. Now, you may be wondering, how the hell did that happen? Well, <laughs> stop. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Tessa Faye. Now see, I know I look happy right now, but trust me when I say I have a serious problem. Now, I know what you might be thinking. What kind of problems could a not too bad looking upper middle class bitch in her mid 20s possibly have? We'll see, the thing is. You know, I feel really good when I'm around you. Uh huh. With you, I just feel like I can be myself. But like with the other girls I've been with. Wait for it. And that's why I, I want to be straight with you. See? It all started when I got raped as a child by my dad. He beat me up a lot too. So I ran away at age 16 and uh, I've been chopping up and raping women ever since. I'm kind of waiting on a court order at the moment. But I'm a better person now, I swear. Eight months, strictly murder free. By now, you must have guessed it, every guy I attract is a serial killer. And the worst part is, I'm kind of used to it by now. Like, my ex was one as well. He was like, the worst of the worst. I'm talking 35 victims. Hey, give me a shot, I'ma need it. Thanks. And the worst part is, they all look like me. Like, how many mixed women do you even know? Exactly. All the ones in the city are probably dead at this point. Anyway, it was hard to deal with at first. But I kind of learned to live with it. I mean control what he does, right? So, not like I'm really responsible or anything. So, uh, is that okay with you? Do you want to go on another date sometime? Uh, actually, my, uh, cat is, uh, calling me on oh. Skype, and, uh, I, I, I really gotta take this, okay. so, uh, I, I'll be Alright, uh, Bye. text me. Bye! Again, Jesus fucking ah oh, fuck it. You guys already know this part. I told you I don't you live know. with her. So, John, what's he doing here? Oh hi, Tess. How did they go? What do you think? Another one, huh? Yes. I win. You still haven't told me what the fuck he's doing here. So, how you been? Get out. Oh what? I can't just hit up my ex and say hi. No. Also, how the hell did you get out of jail? And who the hell is she? How do you know just she? <laughs> Jealous much? I can literally see the manicure on her fingernails, you moron. Take me back, Tessa. You should be honored. Third time escaping. You're the first person I see. No. Fine. Well, at least help me get rid of her. The cops are on my trail. I don't care. It's your fucking fault she's dead. If you hadn't disgusted me with women, I wouldn't have started raping and decapitating them. Tss. Men. Police! Put your hands Drop up. the knife! Drop the knife! You have the right to remain silent. Everything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. <clears throat> this isn't over, Tess. I'll kill you, you fucking bitch! Yeah, yeah, see you on death row, asshole. Hopefully. I wish I was as productive as you where I could eat leftovers all the time. Yeah, it's easy when you're not cooking. Who's there? It's the police, ma'am. We were wondering if we could ask you a few questions. Sure. Hi. I'm Detective Ciroy with the police. Um, we were just wondering, considering the fact that you knew Jared Brody personally, that if you knew anything about the Ripper King, no, who's that? Well, he's a serial killer we've been trying to apprehend for some time now. Only kills young men. He sexually assaults them, then mutilates them. Then we believe he feeds on his victims once he is finished with them. Oh God, that's, that's terrible. Uh, no detective, sadly, I don't know anything about that. You sure? Our intel says he's probably blonde. Also think he's rather skinny since most of his victims were young and on the thin side. We also think he's very passionate about cooking, 
since he is eating his victims afterwards. Hmm. No, Sally, uh, I don't think I know anyone who fits that description. John! Huh? You know anyone like what the detective described? Beats me. No, sadly, we don't know anyone like that. We'll keep you posted in case we hear anything, though. Yeah, please do. Um, here's my card. You can give me a call if you think of anything. Um, personal numbers on the back. Phew, what a night. Tell me about it. Can't believe fucking Jared came back again. Wanna watch a movie? Sure. What about you? How was your evening? How was it? Uneventful. 